welcome back for more exo zeros content today's video we're going to discuss the top pvp teams and heroes as of february 7 2021 but before that if you want updated exo zeros content please hit the subscribe button it's down below hey guys hope you're doing well what you're looking at right now is the top tier heroes in pvp usage rate way back in january 24 2021 okay so if you can see here um i just want to reiterate that um the new nation which is lenombe is actually about to come in um as of january 24 but as we look at the current top teams what do you see there so there hasn't been much change in in the top hero fc iris is still at the top with 68 percent usage so she hasn't moved for i think um around um since we we entered january so at number two we have fc april at 34 percent usage so she jumps eight spots to second so she was tied with rachel and zeon for the 10th spot uh two weeks ago now she's in second with lenombe as um has uh, basically gone up in terms of usage because of a counter to the stall meta for number three we have their fc rachel so fc rachel also comes to the top so she rounds uh he rounds out the top three with a usage of 32 percent so he jumps actually at seven spots from number 10 as well okay so at four battery is actually up so she's up one spot at 30 percent usage followed by fc garf who has jumped three spots as well at 30 percent and rudley at number six also at 30 percent so they have a three-way tie which places them at four five and six the way that i place ties by the way is um based on the previous record as well so if they they placed um higher than the pre than than what they call this than the others that they have a tie now they're usually uh, on top of them uh, in terms of ranking like four for battery because she was ahead of garf and rudley in the previous ranking okay so we move on to our seventh so we have fc zeon at 28 percent so again he jumps up three 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 places because of the team built by the nombe to counter the stall meta then from eight to nine we have a little a little bit of a drop um, from 8, we have FC Tantalo at 26%. Tantalo, Talia, and Annie actually are tied. So that is why they all have 26%. Um, the biggest drop here would be Tantalo because Tantalo before was, I think, in 2nd place. Now he's in 8th. So he's a minus 6. That's a big drop. Also, you have FC Talia, a minus 3 as well in usage. And FC Annie... 26 percent at a minus three as well so if you take note of the top 10 you only have a mix of um rara is not actually in the top 10 so she's actually exited batteries usage actually increased even without rara so what you have there is majority um you have wasted red heroes and Lenombe heroes that are dominating the top 10 currently. So let's move on to our top teams in PvP. Take note that there are some heroes that aren't in the top tier heroes list that will be in the top teams as I will show you now. So if you can see here the top teams in PvP, 50 teams. Um, I'm sorry, I forgot to mention that. Um, this data is based on uh, the Asian server. So for those who are who don't belong to the Asian server, you might have a different uh, scenario for your top teams. So if you can see here, the top um, used team 
is composed of FC Iris, FC April, FC Rachel, FC Morris, and FC Zion. Special mention to FC Morris because he didn't actually um, he didn't uh, go to the top ten in terms of heroes, but he is here. He is mostly used in this composition, mainly for this composition um, of Iris, April, Rachel, Morris, and Zion. So you can actually also prioritize Zion in, uh, sorry, Morris in your builds if you want to, because he's most used also in the Nombe uh, compositions. The other Lenombe composition, I'll just jump uh, to this line, is FC Iris, FC April, Rachel. In place of Morris, they have Baraka and FC Zion. So you can actually swap those two. FC Baraka's usage also jumped because of this build. So for those who have been using Lenombe, they just swap these two out. Okay. So let's go back to our um, second row that has six teams. So it's FC Iris, Garf, FC Rudley, FC Ramji, and FC Annie. Also for Garf, Garf didn't, uh, sorry, for, for Ramji, Ramji did not um, enter the top 10, but he is here in the top tier teams in PvP. Okay, so actually my my team build belongs to this um i've been using uh, i've been tinkering with mostly wasted red and a splash of north one frosty and actually i like this build because it actually again counters the, the current meta of the stall meta but the problem with this build it when 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 it encounters um Historic republic particularly shell and uh and Jinai, it actually encounters a big problem in terms of uh, what they call this. In terms of Jinai's um, passive, I forgot her passive. Um, anyway, um, I, I usually have a problem uh, with Historic Republic teams composed of uh, Jinai, uh, Shell also with adams or with uh, Jin, so those are my problems for this one for the third level you have their fc iris fc talia fc tantalo fc rera and fc Bat battery with five usage so this is actually your classic stall meta so it's still in place um there are still a lot of players using it and it's actually placing good in your in our top uh, 50 teams in pvp so I'll skip the fourth one. I'll go to the fifth one. So it's FC Iris, um, Dorka, FC Shufraken, or FC Shuf, FC Valentina, and FC Battery with four. So this team, I forgot to highlight um, them in black, but they have, this act is actually your, what do you call this? Your, your, what? They, they're actually a wild card in terms of um, teams that have been in the top 50. So there was actually a bunch of teams that were using Shufrak and Valentina and Bathory. That is why Bathory's usage in the top heroes actually increased also because of this team. And Dorka is actually here to support them because of healing as well. So this actually rounds out your top tier teams in PvP. So... There's actually a big change right now in PvP and, and teams on the top are actually knocking each other out. And um, I'm actually um, excited to and, and looking forward to the next two weeks teams if this stays up or there will be a change in the top teams or in the top heroes in PvP for the 50 teams in Asian server. Okay, so again... For your for your top tier heroes in PvP, Iris is still queen. Um, I think she'll stay there in terms of utility. She has been good. She has been one of the best heroes that we've ever had in terms of utility and overall play. Anyway, guys, if you have any comments, suggestions, if you have any other, you know, um, team compositions that actually you would, you know, 
compared to the current pvp rankings you may put them down below in the comments also please don't forget to subscribe because most of the subscribers that have i'm sorry most of the viewers that have been watching my channel have not been subscribed yet more or less around 80 percent to 70 percent or 70 percent to 80 percent of you guys have not subscribed yet and subscribing really helps out my channel and that with that take care this is the warden and i'm out